so many flowers. Mix of reds and blues and whites. This is so cool. Hey guys, so last Saturday I went to the fan expo that was happening here in Vancouver. Now the tickets for the both days, Saturday and Sunday, were already sold out. But I did buy it just for the Saturday event and I had a few hours just before work to actually go there. I'm glad I didn't stay for the whole day because after circling the entire convention center for like an hour or an hour and a half, you basically seen everything. It, it, it's not that spectacular. It's not like Comic Con where it's like massively gigantic and it takes you hours to see everything. I did meet Wufa right now. I have his autograph and I did shake hands, hands with him and we talked for a bit. He's a really nice guy. He's a big guy too. It cost 30 bucks to, to get an autograph with him and I think it was yeah, $40 to, to get a photo with him. Also, Adam West and Burt Ward, the original Robin, were there as well and some other people too. The lineup to meet Adam West was literally so long it almost went down to the bathroom area. I'm not even joking, that's how long it was. So I lined up to meet Adam West. And it's funny because the lineup for Adam West is so long, but for, for Burt Ward it was like barely anybody. I'm thinking in the back of my head like it's probably going to make the $30 for the autograph like, like before. Well, actually it wasn't. It actually it was $60 to get an autograph with him. Or it can pay sixty dollars to get a photo with him, but the photo has to be in a certain area. Like, in the, like for example, he, he'll go with him in a booth with a backdrop in the background, and, he, and he'll stand next to you, and the, the, a professional photographer will take your photo, and then the photo will be produced, and then you take that photo home with you. So when I found out it was sixty, I literally just left out of the line. There was this lady who was in front of me who basically spoke to Adam West while I was waiting and then when I found out about the price, Adam West saw me leave for front of the and I just left because I'm not paying $60 to meet this certain someone who was a Batman before I mean if the price was a little bit cheaper then yeah obviously there was a, a woman who I noticed who was complaining to, to one of the artists there at the event that she can barely afford uh, even the entrance, the uh, entrance was like twenty dollars for per ticket, and she's raising like four kids and has a very low income job. So these are the things that that uh, these events need to, to think about is that make all the signings, all the all the merchandise, all the uh, photos, you know, at least affordable price, like between ten to twenty dollars at least that way. Someone who is a student or someone who has a very low income job can actually afford to this. But I did buy some merchandise as well, and I did meet the artist who draws for The Simpsons and for Futurama. And for, for 10 bucks, he will draw you as well as a Simpsons character. So I got that as well. So it was a pretty interesting day. Also, I just realized. Um, if you ever seen the movie Ferris Bueller's Day Off, um, Ferris' best friend, he was there too, and I wanted to meet him, but, but I thought, yeah, it's, it's probably going to cost also a lot of money, so I didn't want to spend like, a whole bunch of money just, just to get like, autographs for random people. The guy who played the, uh, Hercules on TV was all, also there as well. I didn't realize that until after uh, I was at home later and I was looking at photos of some people I posted uh, of the event. But overall, for, for a convention like this, it was pretty good. I mean, it, like I said, it was not Comic Con. And I really enjoyed, you know, meeting Lou and, and getting a, a chance to actually go to a comic book convention like this. I mean, I always wanted to go to Comic Con and unfortunately this year I won't be able, able to because Darren can't and the whole idea was to, for, for me and Darren to go together. But th there will always be other Comic Con conventions and my ultimate goal for these comic book conventions is to one day finally meet the man who started off for me with comics, who, who got my passion for comics, which is Stan Lee. And he's going to be in Calgary for, for, for the uh, 
Fan Expo over there, but uh, but end of April, which is really a shame because I'm gonna be on vacation in, in end of June to early July, and I really wish that the Fan Expo in Calgary was happening there because I could have easily went to Calgary to, to to meet him. But like I said, it's always there's always another time for that. What I want to know is if you can meet any famous comic book actor who portrayed a comic book character or even famous actor, who, who would it be? And we'll leave your interesting creative responses in the comment section below. And I will see you guys on Thursday.